Angel. Welcome back to Angel's Light Tarot. Thank you, thank you, thank you for stopping by for your monthly general singles love message for December 2020. I'm going to do something a little bit differently this month. We're going to keep all the cards, yeah, upright. We're going to get, we're going to pull out all the positive energy that we can for upright and for the end of 2020. Angels and guides, positive energy for Leo singles. Yes, yes, and yes. Let's go ahead and add. I'm going to add mm, a bit of the, whoa, whoa. There's a lot going on here. Angels and guides, angels and guides, positive energy, love energy, angels, love energy for, thank you, thank you, thank you, for lovely, lovely Leo. Angels, What's going on? What's the information? Thank you for, mm-hmm, for, we're going to add some angels. I'm going to add the angels deck in here to find out about the love that's going on with Leo singles. You're like, is there going to be any love? In yes, yes, yes. Is there going to be any love? Hmm. Let's go ahead and add, I feel like we need to add the writer's deck. Angels and guides, positive energy, positive energy for love. We are looking for love. Hmm. Love, love, love is love in the air for upright, only upright here. All right, angels, is there love for Leo? Singles, positive energy. Angels and guides, angels and guides, positive energy. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And thank you. Just a few more, Leo. Just a few more. Angels and guides, positive energy. Thank you. And whoa, that is crazy. All right, so let's let's get right into your yes, yes, yes. Positive energy for Leo. We have when it comes to single love, serendipity. Yes, yes, yes. Observe, clear your space. The emperor, the three of diamonds, and the six of spades. So love seems to be all over the place this month. It's popping in and it's popping out. And I feel like you're actually taking a step back and looking at the love that's presenting itself to you this month. With the clear your space, I feel like you're you're literally taking a step back and you're just, you're watching. Mm -hmm. you're, you're definitely watching. With the emperor, I feel like you're looking at love when it comes to you. You're looking at love with this uncertainty. You're looking at love like, you know, are you a part of my destiny? I hear you. I hear you looking at this person like you actually are stepping back and you're wondering, are you... Are you a part of my destiny? Because I'm just not that sure. Okay. Now, that's why it's kind of hit. It's not hit or miss. It's more, you know, maybe, maybe, but I'm not certain about it. Okay. All right. So let's go into your recent past here, Leo. You have the gardener mm -hmm, with the gather, the prosperity, knight of wands, Four of Spades and the Queen of Clubs. So when it came to love in your recent past, you put in a lot of work <sighs> trying to keep this relationship together. And I feel like it was also that relationship had to do with finances. In that, it's almost like you wanted someone to be, you know, as they say, equally yoked. You wanted somebody to pull their weight financially as well. With the Knight of Wands, I feel like I feel like you were always like I don't want to say on them but always be teaching them how to be aggressive when it comes to security in life and with the queen of clubs I feel like you were kind of always having to tell them what to do and that's why you're like uh that was in the recent past but I feel like this time around you don't want to be anyone's parent in love okay now when we look at the middle of the month we have sexuality we have health mm -hmm. health lifestyle the sun six of clubs and the two of hearts. Now this is interesting. When it comes to love in the middle of the month, I feel like you are actually um, 
you're wanting to attract someone or someone's trying to attract you maybe with the health and health lifestyle maybe it's while you're working out maybe it's while you're in gnc maybe it's while it has something to do with health doctors nurses um someone that maybe works in the health profession yes it's just a boy boy are you happy and this could be a, maybe it's a coach a workout coach or fitness guru or whatever it is or or um Whoever it is, it's in the health industry. And now you're like, oh, oh yeah, this person is part of my purpose because this is where I am. I'm working on my health. I'm working on my physical fitness. I'm working on my eating habits. Whatever it is, you're like, you're so in love. Yeah, you are so in love, okay? Now, when we look at the end of the month, we have forgiveness. We have compatibility, multitask, uh-huh, angel therapy. We have the ten of swords, two of spades, and the two of clubs. So by the end of the month, I feel like with this compatibility and forgiveness, because, you know, there's there's quite a few, right? And I feel like, here's the thing, I don't feel like this forgiveness has to do with um, someone, you forgiving someone else. I feel like it's you forgiving yourself, if that makes sense. It's you forgiving yourself. Um, like there, there's, I feel like, I feel like there's a there's a <laughs> okay there's a few people that you're dating this month and um i feel like you're forgiving yourself because there was someone there is someone that you are super super compatible to with the angels therapy it's like this person that was in your life but that is in your life you feel an angel connection with them but I feel like you let them go. You you de you didn't have their you didn't support them. You didn't you didn't give them the time of day. But with the two of spades and the two of clubs, I feel like that that is going to come back around again. You will have a second opportunity. Yeah. Maybe there was someone that was more, um, you know, sometimes we have, we meet, because you're going to meet a few people this month. Sometimes we meet people and there's this that instant physical attraction instant right and you're like yeah that's my person then afterwards you kind of feel like you know they're, they're not really my yeah there's that physical connection yeah there's that sexual connection but will it will it go the distance will this relationship go the distance i feel like there is someone that doesn't have that intense of a connection that you kind of overlooked for that person with a big connection that sexual connection and now you're like uh i don't think I don't think that's my person. I don't think that's my person, okay? Now, when we look at your bonus, yeah, mm -hmm, distorted feminine. Now, this could be also distorted masculine. Now, distorted feminine with the um, life purpose I feel and maturity. I feel like it is your life purpose to see those high intense, um, some people might call them um, those twin flame relationships, you know, and those are such challenging relationships because they are literally your compete, your, your other half, right? But the complete opposite of who you are and trying to fit all of that energy into one life it's really a challenge because everything you are they are not and i'm just gonna leave it like that but there's that that like the moth to a flame burn by the fire like that's so it, unless you are willing both parts are willing to work it out in those twin flame kind of relationships sometimes they are way too intense for a long-term relationship but there are rewards here for you. There's gentleness here for you. There's temperance here for you. The Joker and the Joker. I am almost going to guarantee that you want the gentleness. You want that calm love, not the twin flame kind of love that's causing you to yeah look at yourself in the mirror question you know your life decisions and things of that nature and, and challenge you to go out of your comfort zone you're like no i think i want the peaceful kind of love <laughs> yes 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 but with the joker it only remains to be seen who you choose are you gonna choose the soulmate or the twin flame it is totally up to you Mighty powerful month for you, okay? So, I send you joy, namaste, and much, much love sent your way.